G'day everyone. In this video, I'm going to go through a few things that you need to know before you purchase the Cronus Zen. And for this video, I'm also going to be using Call of Duty as the example because that's the main game that people are using the Cronus Zen for. Let's go. Okay, so first of all, the Cronus Zen is not going to give you aimbot. It's not going to give you wall hacks. I see way too many people online that have purchased one thinking that's what it's going to do. So if the main reason you're thinking about buying a Kronos Sen is to be able to use aimbot or wall hacks or both, don't buy one. It's going to be a waste of your money. It's going to be a waste of your time. That's not what it's made for. Secondly, this is not going to make you a god tier player if you're already average at the game. Let me explain. If you're an average player at this game and you have the Cronus Zen set up properly, you are going to be ever so slightly less average than what you were before. If you're on the other end of the scale and you are completely cracked out of your mind at this game, you'll be ever so slightly more cracked than what you were before. People are buying this expecting it's going to take them from an average player to a pro COD League player overnight once they plug the device in and that's not how it works. The next thing I want to cover is that this device is not a very simple plug and play device. Once you get it out of the box for the first time, there's several steps that you need to follow to make sure it's going to work properly. You're going to need to download the firmware update tool. You're going to need to download and install Zen Studio software, and you also need to register your device. This stuff may sound confusing, but I promise if you follow the instruction manual exactly, it can be done. However, if you are not tech savvy, you're not very good with computers, this part will be a little bit harder for you and using the device in general is going to be a little bit harder to get used to. As well as that, once you have the Cronus Zen set up properly and you have the script installed onto your Cronus Zen, there's still several things that you need to go through and adjust to make sure that script is going to be working properly. Most scripts will have adjustments for anti-recoil for each weapon. Most scripts will have adjustments for the aim assist or whatever uh, mod they're providing. So you still need to go into a game, make a small adjustment, see how that works. If that doesn't work, make some more small adjustments on the Zen and keep repeating that process until you get it perfect. If you don't have the patience for this, then I recommend not buying it because it does take a while sometimes. The next thing I want to cover is that if you want to use the Cronus Zen with a controller, which most people would be, you need to be prepared to use that controller when it's plugged in via USB. You need to be prepared to use the controller wired. There is wireless options. The Cronus Zen does have Bluetooth, but I promise you most people are using it wired for several reasons. The Bluetooth isn't the best. Some people have to buy a USB Bluetooth adapter that plugs into the front of the Zen. It's just, it's a bit of a mess. Just trust me, use it wired, have it plugged in. It's a much better option. Be prepared for that. The last thing I'm going to talk about is the mods that you'll be using on the Cronus, and those are called scripts. Those scripts are free. Do not pay for scripts. I can't make this any clearer. Do not pay for scripts. They are free. There's plenty of people out there that make these scripts and put them out for free, and they're great and they work, but there's also people out there that download those free scripts, change the name of it, and then put it on their own website or put it somewhere and try and sell it. Do not pay for the scripts. They are free and they work well. And there we go. That's everything I wanted to cover. So hopefully this video has helped you out a little bit if you're thinking about buying the Cronus Zen. Uh, if you've made it this far, thanks for watching the video. And uh, that's it. See you later.